Hey everyone, today I'm going to be talking about the new uh, Milani Baked Blushes. I have two of the new shades because they're super pink and I just had to get the super pink ones to show you guys, of course. Um, so we have number 10, the Liz Delizioso Pink and Bella Rose. Now, uh, Bella Rose also shares its name with one of the Coming Up Roses blushes that came out last year. They're two different shades. Um, I think it was Bella Rosa, Bella Rose. Um, so let's start with number 10, which is Delizio Pink. And by the way, it's in that gold reflective packaging. It's got the matte back with the name on it. Um, when you open it up, you have your you have your blush here and then when you lift it up so you're getting only that much product you have your little mirror and you have a little blush brush I personally hate these brushes but this is pretty decent in quality I've seen some really bad plasticky ones it's plastic but it's not as bad like it's not obviously horrible plastic so let me just wash this up so very smooth very soft in texture and it really is nice to apply and it shears out nicely so you can go from super intense to just soft feminine flushed kind of look which is really nice because sometimes you don't want that full burst of pigment especially when we're talking about blush and then the next shade we have is a Bella Rosa and this one was really intimidating in the packaging because of how hyper fuchsia it is like damn hyper fuchsia but when you swatch this up again you have that hyper fuchsia but, and it swatches Hyper Fuchsia, and this one, you can sheer out, and I have a feeling that this shade, because it's still dark, even on my light skin tone, will be better for medium to darker skin tones, but if you like that very, very high fashion, very, very bold look, you do the whole Crete contour, highlight, you do that whole routine, then this might not be out of your color range. Um, if you're a more minimalistic person, you might want to pick up the lighter pink, especially if you're a lighter skin tone, because this might be just too red on your skin tone, unless you're either severely blending it out or you're looking for that very very you know cut blush kind of look like a la the 80s so depending on your personal style preference your skin tone how you wear your blush you might want to be a little bit picky with these well this looks really pretty on the dresser um girly girly problems <laughs> anyway um check out milani i'll leave their link below you can find these in drugstores but if you don't want to hunt them down in your drugstores you can find them on their website currently so that's what i'll leave the link to um i will have these swatched up in picture form at the end of this video and i also will have them on my instagram thank you so much for watching and please follow me on instagram i'm recycled stardust